Hey everybody, it's Mitch again from Mitch's Daily English Neighbor Blog Facebook page. And don't forget about my application, Mitch's Mitchin Yonga. You can study English with me. You can learn how to speak like a native English speaker. It's time to it's time to learn how to speak like a native English speaker so that you can have good relationships with foreigners, so that you can have good business uh, connections, good networking situations in your business when you go traveling, whatever the situation, it's time to speak like a native English speaker. So check it out, MitchInEnglish.com. You can learn with me. All right, well, I have a good phrase for you today. It's the last resort. The last resort. What does that mean? The last resort, you know, like a like a nice uh, nice resort hotel on the beach. No, it's not talking about that kind of resort. The last resort, that means uh, the last thing you can do, the last choice you have, the last plan, all right? You know, we have to say plan A, and then we have plan B. We say always have a plan B. Plan B means backup plan. Okay, that's the last resort. But the last resort is not plan B. There's plan A, plan B, and then usually there's like plan C, D, E, F. The last resort, that means the last plan, Z, plan Z. After you, you planned many things, after nothing worked, didn't work, this one didn't work, A didn't work, B, C didn't work, now we're down to D, that's the last resort. Okay, so that just means the last thing you can do. The final chance. Okay, the final chance. So uh, this is, it comes from resort means, uh, we often use this phrase. We say, I had to resort to doing something. Verb, okay? Uh, resort to, uh, like, so for example, you didn't buy any groceries. You know, you're, you didn't go to the store. You, you didn't have any money, so you had no food in the house. Then you can say, oh, I had to resort to eating the miyok, miyok from the miyoku. I just ate as an anju. Yeah, be careful. I know, I know someone who ate uh, miyok for anju because he had no food in the house. So he ate miyok and he had to go to the emergency room because they were pulling miyok out of his out of his throat because it gets as you drink beer it gets uh, swollen in your stomach so don't do that very very dangerous but anyway just an example you could say i had to resort to eating milk for my anju because i had no food in the house so resort to that just means when you have nothing else no other options then you have to resort to doing something okay and another way to say it is my last resort was blah 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 same meaning okay the last resort was eating miyokuk that's a dumb example let me think of another example uh let's say you know you have you have a friday night it's fire friday night time to go drinking uh but your friends are all busy all your girlfriends are busy your friends are busy you you have a free night but nobody can hang out with you but you really want to go to the club you want to go drink soju what do you do well, you say, oh, man, what about that one guy? You know, I had that one friend. I don't like him. He's kind of weird, kind of annoying. Uh, all right. Nobody else. I have nobody else, so I'll call him as a last resort. Yeah, the poor guy. That's not nice. You should call him. Call him. He's probably lonely on a Friday night. Just call him. But anyway, that's an example. Another terrible example. Sorry. Here's another example. Uh, you know, I have a friend who, you know, they... The two friends, a man and a woman, when they were younger, they said, you know, we are going to date. We're, they're just friends. They're not boyfriend and girlfriend. But they said, when we get to be 40, when we're 40 years old, uh, if we don't have a husband or a wife yet, either of us, then as a last resort, we are going to marry each other. We're going to marry each other. That was their promise. They. This is a true story. They said we're going to marry each other at 40 if neither of us are married as a last resort right well guess what they're almost 40 and both of them are still single so we'll see if uh if that happens i don't know i'm going to remind them soon because it's coming very very soon so as a last resort they said they were going to get married i think they're going to have to i don't know a lot of bad examples today, I'm sorry. But anyway, you get the point. When you have no other options, no other choices, as a last resort, 
this is what you're going to do. All right. All right. Go ahead and download my application. And as a last resort, you can study English with me. Yeah. I may be your last choice. Oh, no. I hope not. But go ahead and get it, and I'll help you.